Hello guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. I have a couple of self-care appointments and I thought that it would be fun to just bring you along, share the process. Today I have a Brazilian wax appointment and a facial, which I'm very excited about because I haven't had a facial in a few months and I'm gonna be trying out a brand new place. I have to head out here pretty soon so I wanted to just kind of show you what I'm wearing. I can't put any makeup on since I'm getting a facial in a few hours but I wanted to put on something summery and like, you know, still feel kind of cute with my outfit. So this dress is from H&M. I love it, the color is so cute. And then I have these sandals from Target. Also these sunglasses that I am obsessed with that I just recently got from TJ Maxx. They're from Vince Camuto. I literally just got them last week. So I would check your local TJ Maxx and see if they have them, but I just, I love the style of them. Then we just gotta put on a little bit of perfume. This is the Ambery Saffron perfume from Dossier. It's a dupe for the Baccarat Rouge 540. And speaking of which, this portion of the video is sponsored by Dossier. Thank you so much to them. Dossier makes dupes for designer fragrances. By cutting out licensing fees, retailer markups, and celebrity marketing, they can offer the exact same fragrance same scent, same quality for 70 to 90% less. They have dupes for brands like Tom Ford, YSL, Joe Malone, but their fragrances start at $19, which is amazing. And let me tell you, I've been wearing Dossier fragrances for about two years now, and I am just never going back. I have not purchased a brand name fragrance since I started purchasing from Dossier because it's just a total waste of money. And if you know me, you know that I do like to treat myself. I like to pamper myself, but I also like to be frugal in places where I can be. If I can get the exact same fragrance for a fraction of the price in just a simpler looking bottle, why not do that? And then I have extra money left over so that I can treat myself to things like getting a facial and getting my nails done and stuff like that. Like I've mentioned a million times, the Ambry Saffron has been my go-to lately. I love it, it lasts such a long time. So if you guys wanna check out Dossier, I will have a link and a discount code in my description that will save you 10% off your order. And they also have a new payment method that allows you to earn store credit. So don't forget to select catch as you are checking out. Again, all of that information will be in my description. Thank you so much Dossier for sponsoring this portion of the video. Now let's head over to our wax appointment. I please do a grande vanilla sweet cream cold brew. How's it going? Good, how are you? I'm doing great. It's going to be 508 today. Okay. You kind of look like, um, are you on TikTok? No. Okay, that's not. <laughs> well, you're another person then. Awesome, Thank you have a great you. one. You too. What is a self-care treat yourself day without Starbucks? Am I right? <laughs> I try to not get this often, but you know, every once in a while, it's nice to have as a treat. And that's so funny that that guy asked if I was on TikTok. I should have been like, I'm not on TikTok, but I am on YouTube. Wanna be in my video? So I just got done with my wax. I go to Waxing the City, which is a chain. So I would look and see if they have one where you live it's similar to european wax center which is where i used to go but european wax center the time that they block out for their waxes is a lot shorter they only block out 15 minutes for a brazilian wax but at waxing the city they block out 30 minutes so they're able to do smaller strips of wax which makes it less painful and i feel like they just put in more care and it doesn't feel as rushed but i've been getting brazilians now for a few years I started in 2017, so it's been five years, which is so crazy. This lighting is like so in and out. Um, but yeah, it, I've been getting them for five years now, and 
they're amazing. Like I will not go back to shaving. I used to shave before and you know, I always would deal with razor burn and razor bumps and when the hair is growing back in, it's like pokes so much and it can be really uncomfortable and it grows back in so quickly. But with waxing, because they're pulling the hair completely from the follicle, um, when the new hair grows back in, it has like a nice soft tapered tip to it. So it's a lot softer. It's not as uncomfortable and like poking you. And over time, as you wax regularly, the hair, grows back slower and it doesn't grow back in as thick and it can grow in a little more sparse too. So I go and get waxed every four weeks and I really, if I wanted to, I could push it out to like five or six weeks. But at this point, like my whole area down there, the hair is like so soft and so fine. And even when I am at the full four weeks and it's like time for me to get a wax, you can't even tell like from a distance, you can barely even like, see that I have hair at all. It's like so fine and sparse. And I have like some areas, it's like kind of patchy too. Like there's some areas where hair doesn't grow at all anymore. So it's pretty amazing. Highly, highly recommend. It's just life changing. It is very painful. The very first time you ever go, it's gonna hurt like a bitch. But as you keep going, it becomes more and more tolerable. And you know, obviously at this point I'm like, having full conversations through the entire thing. Totally worth it. And if you live in the Wilmington area, I go to Sam at Waxing the City in the Barclay Point Plaza. She really takes her time to like explain everything to you. And they do have a rewards program, which is pretty cool. This is not sponsored, but um, most like chain places, like even European Wax Center, I know has something like that where you can like either purchase a bundle or set up like auto payments and then you can save a little bit of money. So if you are gonna be going regularly, it definitely makes sense to do that. So it ends up being a little bit cheaper. Um, but it's just one of those things that to me, it's totally worth spending that extra money every month. And I always just feel so good right after a wax. Like I just feel fresh and reborn and like super clean. It's about 12.30 now. My facial is at two. So I think I'm just gonna go home and make myself some lunch. I will check back in when it's time for the facial. Okay, it is facial time, I'm so excited. So I am going to Lauren at Soul Skin Studio and I'm getting the Soul Facial, I believe it's called. And I mean, my skin is pretty good these days. I mean, I have a little bit of like discoloration, kind of, sort of, that I have been working on evening out, but I haven't had any breakouts in a while. So I don't really have like problematic skin, but one thing that I always thought was you only go to get facials if you have issues with your skin and there's something that you need to work on improving. But I'm realizing that that's not the case. Like facials are just really relaxing and it's so nice to just kind of treat yourself and like just the massage that they give you while they're doing the facial is so nice. It's also just really important to get it professionally taken care of every so often and get a nice deep clean, get extractions done and all of that. I kind of think of it like going to the dentist. Like, yes, we brush our teeth at home every day and we take care of our teeth at home, but you still have to go to the dentist a couple times a year for a professional cleaning. So I kind of treat facials the same way. And I will say I've learned so much. Even though I went to cosmetology school and I technically learned about skin, I've just learned so much from going and getting facials done as far as like, you know, what I should be doing, what I should be using, etc. So I really have to credit the way my skin looks to going and getting past facials and you know, everything that I've picked up and learned along the way.
going to do a little enzyme um, on you for exfoliation. Okay. And then we'll do a little bit of brightening and kind of calming with some sulfur. And then what do we feel? Are you okay if I use a little bit of goat's milk yogurt too? Oh, yeah. Okay. So this is that mixture of the goat's milk yogurt with some oats to calm and strengthen the skin and then a little bit of pumpkin and pomegranate enzymes. Smells good. Yeah, and some sulfur, which is going to detox and reduce redness. And then a little bit of golden seal extract.
Just finished my facial. Oh, this, let me get this angle. There we go. Okay. It looks so glowy. It was so nice. Thank you so much. Yeah, of course. I'm so glad you liked it. So I am Lauren, holistic esthetician and owner of Soul Skin Studio. And I just gave Sam a holistic customized facial. It was the Soul Facial and she got all of the works fully customized masks and full massage and extractions which uh it looked amazing so yeah oh my god the yeah. massage was the best part good amazing yeah it looks so good <laughs> thank you so much you're welcome can we see you in again that was amazing i will have lauren's information in the description highly highly recommend she was so sweet and i love that everything was customized like the masks that she did on me she took a look at my skin was like okay these are you know like the things i feel like you need so and then she was telling me like all the ingredients she was adding to the mask and what each one did and why and I just love that. I love whenever I go to get a service done when the person is like very informative because it just shows me, I mean, A, I get to learn a lot, which is nice because like I said earlier, then I can like implement these things at home. But also it just goes to show that they really know what they're talking about and they're passionate about their craft. She said that my skin looked pretty good, but I am starting to get like a tiny bit of rosacea in this area. She said that you know, that's just kind of typical when you move to a new climate, which makes sense. Um, she said that she's actually from up north as well, and the first, like, year of her living down here, it her skin needed some time to adjust. So, yeah. Oh, my God. My skin looks so glowy and amazing. I am so happy. I am going to head home now. It's the end of the night. I got home and immediately started doing a bunch of work and completely forgot to film an outro to this video, so here we are. Thank you guys so much for watching and spending the day with me. Don't forget to check the description for the link and my discount code to Dossier, and I'll see you really soon in my next video. Bye.